Okay, we need to start it with our minds. Alright. Alright, ready? Ready? <laughs> ah, I see the red dot! There All we right. go. Woo! Alright. What's up everybody? Hey. I'm Mac Jaw, Nathan. I'm, I'm Rhino Saucerist, Ryan. Ryan. This is Baxter, you can't see him, he's out of shot. He probably will be the whole time. And this is gonna be our first rant video. Yep. I don't know if I'll be doing these like solo or like I don't know, Ryan's here, so I asked him to be in it, and he was like, okay, why not? You gave me a burrito this morning, and I was like, now that I say that, this sounds kind of gay. <laughs> I didn't a, mean it to. From a burrito place, he bought a burrito. I don't know, that could be bad, too. Well, it's a burrito. I like burritos. With egg and cheese. And chorizo. Freaking delicious. Baxter, yeah. shut up! Okay, so, lately, I've been listening to a lot of music. And watching, uh, you know, YouTube videos and stuff, and uh, I get really frustrated really quick about things that matter. Um, and uh, one of the things that matters to me is, uh, you know, music and YouTube. YouTube doesn't have anything to do with this whole rant. Music does. What happened to? Let, uh, let, 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 let me start off with this. Kids Bop. You ever got? You guys ever heard of Kids Bop? Probably. A lot of them. Kids Bop used to be like in sync and like Britney Spears and stuff. Yay, happy times! And they wouldn't like. Oh, well, Britney Spears was always pretty weird. Well, Britney Spears was weird, but I mean, it wasn't like out there with like, hey, you're hot, bro, Sif, Joe, Ding, Dog. <laughs> I don't know. But it bothers me nowadays when, you know, 10 year old kids. I'm only 18, let me, let me preface that. He's 18, I'm 18. It bothers me when kids are singing LMFAO songs and, uh, what was that? Moves Like Jagger by, uh... I don't know, I don't listen to rap. It's not rap, it's like pop or something. Maroon 5. Moves Like Jagger by Maroon 5, which is clearly about other things that kids should not be singing about. I'm gonna kind of censor myself here, although I probably shouldn't, but I'm gonna kind of do it, because... I don't probably got younger viewers. Yeah, I probably I think I have a quite a bit quite a beat. Quite a few. Quite a bit of younger viewers. But like, I don't know. I listen to a lot of rock. Sometimes not even sometimes. Metal, I listen to a lot of metal. Metallica, I listen to Metallica. They pretty much stick on their course. It's about love, heartache. Sometimes it's really, really dark, but it still sounds good. I mean it, it doesn't make you want to like murder yourself. Sometimes they have bad words, but Usually so, not. A lot of times they have bad. Well, no, sometimes. Metallica sometimes. doesn't usually have a lot of bad words. Yeah. Except for their garage stuff. Don't don't listen to that if you, if you don't <laughs> yeah. have bad words. Um, but like, I don't know. It's easy to relate to where like rap is all about the same stuff. It's like women, sex, and drugs and money. That's it. That's it. Like all the time, you can only say the word the the p word about the lady parts so many times in a song and they do it like I don't know 50 times past every, the allowed every amount five words I guess yeah it's ridiculous I mean I get that rappers like their money and their women that's cool but don't tell your life story over and over in every song and don't try to appeal to younger people yeah like Eminem I actually kinda like Eminem he's mm -hmm. a good rapper he's, he's the only one song of his I even listen to uh, Mockingbird? Mm -hmm. which one? Lose Yourself Lose Yourself, that's a good song. Mockingbird is my favorite song. It tells a story. Like, it's a really sweet song, and it's not about, I hate people, and I'm going to shoot them in the face with my gat, son. What? I'm not black, I'm sorry. Oh, God, I just went racist. Just kidding. I'm, I'm not. I'm not racist either. Like, I'm so far from racist, it's ridiculous. Like, I love everybody, or hate them equally, which, whichever you want to look at. Uh, but... I don't know, there's just so much, like, rock good stuff. Like, I would show you, but I'm pretty sure it's copyrighted and that would be bad. And I, have, I have a few friends that do rap, and there's one guy I know. Uh, his name is also Ryan, you probably know him. Is that B? B, Ryan B? B. Yeah. Berg Bar Barfin? Barker. Oh, yeah. And uh, <clears throat> he does do rap songs, but, I mean, he'll have a couple customers here and there, but he holds back on it. And it's not and even, like... It's not bad, and it actually sounds really good, but the way I see it is, for usually, when I usually hear a rap song, all I hear is, blah, 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 blah. that's all I can hear. Beep, 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 money. Beep, yeah. beep, boop, beep, 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 beep,
guns. The, Beep. the only tune they have is. Yeah. And it's always the same bass line. Yeah. Like, always. I like techno and dubstep too. It takes but no skill. It doesn't. That's it. Not at all. I could make a dubstep song, right? I, in fact, I have made a dubstep song. It was some free website where I created a dubstep song and I was like, whoa, this is melting my brain. It took me like five minutes to create a dubstep song. I'm not even j joking. Now, I don't give discredit to dubstep and techno. They're really good songs. They have cool beats. They have cool sounds and stuff. But rap is literally the same. There's this new song called Knock Knock by Matt Miller, I think is his name. Terrible song. Absolutely freaking terrible. Like, he's some new rapper. He's oh, white. Okay. Okay. He's it, sounds the song is like knock knock, pff, pff, knock knock, pff, and it's like dumb. And I was like, that's it. I pretty much actually. And then he talks about his like whole life story, how he grew up in the hood, and how all of the women around him are like, oh my god, knock, knock. Yeah. and he's like this new rapper that only has one song, and people are like, oh my god, knock, knock. it's people like that that give like ten years olds, ten year olds to like, I don't know, 16 year olds, like this false sense of awesomeness. And what I, I don't like is, <clears throat> most the only song kids listen to is rap. We've already said that like four times. Yeah. But <clears throat> because of that, they're talking like they're 40. Not yeah. 40, like in their late 20s, like swearing all the time. The other day we and were at the mall, remember? And yeah. those two little kids, they were like 12 and they were cussing. Yeah, uh, it's like, you can, if you want to hear this, just go on Xbox Live or PlayStation Network. Exactly. All the freaking squeakers on Xbox Live. And PlayStation Network. And, and PlayStation and Network and PC and YouTube. They're all cussing. Stop it. Yeah. Stop cussing. There's no need for cussing. You said, you're just a boy. You ain't ta talk like that. I mean, it's not even like the cussing. I mean, the cussing really gets to me. But, like, it's all the, like, sexual stuff that's in songs that kids are like, oh, this must be okay. I swear, by the time my kids are in school, they're going to know more about sex than I ever will. Yeah. I'm just saying. Like, they're <laughs> going to be like, likely. they're going to be like, dad, look. And I'm going to be like, oh my God. No. And if you look, if you look at the differences between like maybe 10, 15 years ago when nowadays through censorship on TV, they stopped censoring a lot of words. Yeah. What and happened to the days we're saying like, I like don't want saying, to say. Saying Jesus Christ was bad. Yeah. Or like, how it's okay to say ass but not whole? How does that make sense? It's like They're the, like, ass. Oh. Yeah. Huh? That doesn't even make sense. How does that make sense? And like, when people say, uh, like, say, what the hell, for instance, like, or say, you're going to hell, right? They don't believe that out anymore. No. And they used <laughs> to all the time. Like, it was bad to have those and words. I'm not going any further because I honestly don't really feel comfortable saying that. Yeah, I, I tried to actually censor that, but I couldn't get my point across without saying, you know, the words. And I don't know how to do beeping sounds yet, but I don't think it really matters just now. So, I mean, like, even now, like, I could have censored that and not said it, but I didn't because I, it's approved all of a sudden. Like, yeah. I get that we're evolving as a modern society, but when 12-year-olds, like, cuss and stuff, it bothers me. Yeah, like, it bothers me extremely, and apparently now that the cuss word for poop, yeah, <laughs> yeah <laughs> that apparently is not allowed to be bleeped out anymore, that's okay. On what? TV. Really? Yeah. Oh, only, like, if they give you, like, a forewarning, then it's okay. But still. still <laughs> It used to not be like that. Uh, Usually used to, the four used to not be able to say like hell. You used to not be able to say booby. And, yeah. And now it's like saying everything in the book. Yeah. There, it's it's insane. And it's not even like just the cussing though. Like I said, it's like all the sexual stuff that's in songs. Pop songs. Oh my God. I'm sorry, Baxter. I probably scared you. I just shook my bed. <laughs> all the pop songs are either about Baxter. sex or like, I don't even know what else. I don't listen to a lot of pop. But like rock songs, they're actually kind of nice. Like if you can get past like the kind of like rocky tones that they do, like the kind of like growling, not even the growling because that's more metal, but rock in general, like uh, disturbed. Yeah. If you can get past like the way the music sounds, they're actually really good lyrics. They're kind of metaphorical, so if you don't think metaphorically, it's, it's a little bit harder. And sorry about my nose, it's really itchy, I'm not on crack. 
He's on crack. No, no, shut up. He listens to too much rap and pop and. It's just and, itchy. Shut up. And country. No, country is actually really cool. I like. Yeah, country. I listen to that a lot. Opera? How can people not listen to opera? Ugh. What? I so, love opera. The only one I listen to is from freaking like I don't know what. Uh, what was? Step Brothers? No, I think it was like King Arthur. Porti Volare? No, oh, King Arthur. Symphony music? Apocalyptica? I really like I symphony that, music. Yeah. Okay. I am a sucker for a violin. Any kind of violin music, I'm like, oh. Last of the Mohicans. It's so pretty. Oh. That's how I feel about violins. All right. Yeah. And drums? Drums are like hardcore stuff. I love drums. Yeah, and I've been trying to learn guitar recently, and I've been using the game, the game that recently came out for it. I'm not going to say it because then we get copyright notice. Yeah, I think so many copyright notices. But, uh... It's that brand new guitar game that came out. You'll know it when you hear what I say. But uh, when I got it, it came with a guitar. And the reason why I wanted it in the first place was because I think it'd be cool to learn guitar. And what made me want to learn it was, well, Metallica, basically, because I like their music. It's my favorite. And Van Halen. Van Halen. Although they were always about sex. Yeah. Always. And it's not even like, you're, you, you bring up a good it's, point there. It's, it's not even just modern music. It's like older music too. I mean, I guess it's p kind of part of it. I mean, theirs is just sub. Yeah. Like so, kids can't pick it up. Yeah. Like I mean, "Welcome to the Jungle." That song is actually about sex. Yeah, and no one know when kids listen to it, they think about a jungle. Yeah, they think of monkeys. Yeah. And King Kong. Blah, blah, blah. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. Yeah. Exactly. But nowadays, when they want to sing about sex, they literally just say, "Let's do it." Yeah, they just say, "Let's hey, get down." Sex. Right now. Yeah. I hate it. And, and I know everybody they're not really has subtle anymore. Yeah, no, they're not subtle at all. I know everybody has their own personal taste in music and truly this whole series of either me solo or me and Ryan is totally opinionated. Yeah. Like beyond opinionated. I'm just like I should have said that in the beginning. But it's beyond opinionated. You can have your own opinion, you can leave your opinion down in the comment below and I'll be like, oh, ho, 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 you silly monkey. But I don't know. I just I just get really frustrated with some stuff lately. I like my computer right now is even being a butt because it's like Woo! with the stupid fan. They could probably you might not be able to hear it. Uh, I don't know. You might I be able know. to. You might not. If there's like a weird Woo! sound in the back, it's because my computer oh. is like. Woo! But yeah. I don't know. Just music in general is like it's in every part of our life, and because of that, it's not good. Like I I. I like rap, but not all kinds of rap. I like kind of old school rap where it actually talks about stuff and not just, yeah. you know, money, drugs, and, and women. The, I mean, they were found out <clears throat> for lip syncing, but uh, one people that was, one band that was pretty much about love and sex was Milli Vanilli. Oh, yeah. 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 They're pretty popular. Yeah. Well, and they, they got caught for uh, Yeah. They're, they never sang a single song. Never. And all they do is... Uh, uh, yeah. And, I mean, like... Even they were subtle. I mean, I don't know who wrote their songs, but it was still subtle-ish. A Christian person. Really? How much you want to bet? I don't know. How much you want to bet? I'm a Christian person straight anything. up went, Say this! <laughs> but they were like, We He's ain't gonna Christian, say that. I am Christian. I'm and I listen to angry music. How does that make sense? I listen to... Actually, let me, let, me, let me erase that. I listen to everything. Opera, country, rock, metal, rap. Not usually rap. My shadow fits into my shirt collar. Sorry, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Rap, I listen. I listen to it, but not all the time. Not hardly ever. There's a couple songs that I like. Like, let me get back to you on that. <laughs> dubstep, I really like dubstep, but because there's like never any lyrics, hardly ever. With some of the newer songs, they're starting to put in lyrics into it, but it sounds good. Man, he doesn't like dubstep. I don't and know. What I, what I also find funny is that I'm mean, a little kid who's been doing this their whole life just so they wouldn't get in trouble. Like, lying, I mean, sure, it'll happen. They're kids. They're going to do it. But when they lie about their parents being dead, and you ever get those kids? Like, okay, <clears throat> I've been on Xbox Live all the time, okay? And I'm always finding these kids who are always swearing and cussing and saying everything in the book. I say, Put your mother in the microphone. And she goes, she's dead. Oh, I've heard that. And then, or their father, they're dead. And I'm like, dude, They up. think it's funny, too. Like, yeah. it doesn't make any sense. Yeah, and with 
doesn't make sense to me is when they cuss, it's bad, but their sense of humor is so... It's so dark. Blank. Blank? blank? Yeah, it's bland, I should say. Bland and dark, usually. Yeah, and when they have that kind of sense of humor, that's bad. I mean, it's terrible. I'm all for letting the kids live and learn, like, say, hey, the climate tree, they fall, they hurt themselves, they ain't gonna do that again. I'm, I'm for that. But letting them do everything they want, so, like, how they talk, how they dress, what they do, and I'm just, doing that, that's kind of borderline, but how they talk is just retarded. I mean, yeah, the, the saying retarded used to not be allowed either. Yeah. And I mean, gay. I think gay was kind of banned too yeah. for a while. And then, what else was banned? And I mean, it's it's popular culture, and that's kind of what this is all about. Like, music has a lot to do with it. Movies, music. Mo movies aren't even that bad. I mean, we've pretty much had the same movies throughout, except for... Well, actually, no, we've pretty much had the same kind of style movies. But music has always changed. Mm -hmm. And because of music, everybody listens to music. And if you don't, you listen to classic music. And if you don't listen to classic music... You, I don't know what you do. You listen to music at some point in time in your life, at least yeah. 30 million times. So Whether it, you just like hum some random tune, that's music. Yeah. Whether, I mean, it may not... You watch a movie all. with orchestral da 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 in the background, or, that's still music. Or an intro, or you just... Exactly. Maybe your friend or your brother has like a piano or a violin or something, and you just play a couple keys and maybe a chord or two. That's music. I mean, it may not sound good, but it's music anyways. <laughs> I mean, it, it's such a part of our life, and just how it is today in the modern society is just not good. Yeah. I mean, modern music isn't bad. You just have to find the right stuff. And usually the stuff that sounds good is either inspired by classical music or totally new that you've never heard it before. Like dubstep, I've never, I had never heard before before I heard of a certain artist. And, uh, We've been concentrating on music this whole time. Let's move on to movies. Movies? Yeah. But movies have stayed pretty much the no, same. No, they have not. How do you say? Alright. Say <clears throat> there's a sci-fi movie like back in like the 80s or the 70s, okay? Or the 90s even. Or a TV show even, okay? Like mm -hmm. <clears throat> X-Files. Same. Uh -huh. Okay, that was good. They had a couple bad words here and there. They didn't show any nudity, right? And nowadays, they do show nudity, or they... Suggested highly. I mean, the only <clears throat> sort of nudity X Files did have was they they were in the morgue, and that's how stuff actually is. And if you watch a movie, like say the low budget ones, like Python, Anaconda, Piranha, all yeah, those. Yeah, those are low budget. Yeah, they're low budget, and the only way they can get people to watch is yeah, by showing movies. Yeah, and nudity, pretty much. And even in really good movies, like Three Hundred, that was one of the coolest movies ever, and yet it had like. It had a lot of Ten movies. Ten minutes of boobs and... And sexual content. Yeah. And then... What other movies we got here? Uh, but I think with movies, it's more of an art form. A lot of people... Not a lot of people. Some people, yeah. like, look at nudity as like, Oh my god, nudity! But it's like art. In a weird, creepy way. Yeah, like the Statue of David. Yes! Perfect example. Good job. Ten bunny points for you. <laughs> I don't know where the brownie points are located, though, so you have to go find those. Well, the points don't matter. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Baxter, don't look at me like that. I don't know. Movies have stayed similar. They've stayed relatively the same. I mean, they've been a lot of changes, but not big changes. Yeah, not huge, drastic changes. Music has made... We're talking about life and, and stuff. Videos. And now we're talking about ladies and butts and money and yeah. drugs. And, and, like, video games as well. I mean... They have had games with nudity, but they were so low quality you couldn't even tell what they were. But nowadays, with even with the graphic enhances, they've tried to put them into games. Like, yeah, like on purpose. Yeah, like DC Universe, Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat versus DC Universe. Uh, what else? We got a Dead or Alive series. We got the. Uh, yeah, those are all very suggestive. Yeah, Final Fantasy. You have uh, anime to thank for that. You what? You have anime to thank for that. Yeah. Everything anime has big boobies. Yeah. And gigantic muscles. And what are, what are the oh, games? Oh. <clears throat> uh, and crazy hair. Anime hair is pretty crazy cool. Crazy hair. I did anime hair in Saints Row. Anyways, what other game am I trying to think of? Uh, uh, Dante's Inferno. 
I never liked Dante's Inferno. It was a good game, but the demo was cool. Yeah, but it still had a lot of boobs. Because yeah. it was like the cinematic was half the whole thing. Yeah. Uh, what else? We got perfect. If you go on to Xbox Live Arcade, you have this thing called indie games. There's people who purposely make games with nudity and all that. Catherine? Have you ever seen that? No. It's like kind of anime style, comic style? No, I've never And seen it. the whole purpose of the game is like you're in this relationship with this girl, but she like breaks up with you or something, so you keep having these dreams where you're dressed as a sheep and you have to go through these puzzles. And like, there's this one level where this giant butt tries to eat you, and um. That's weird. Don't talk about it. There's boobies. <coughs> ah, figured it's anime. Yeah. Yeah. What is he doing? He's cleaning himself. Oh. Uh, I thought he was trying to eat the case for track line. Anyways, um, uh, I lost my train of thought. Wonderful. Uh. What were we talking about? We were ranting about how things changed. Movies. Affecting children. Yeah, children. Children of the future. And right now the future is children not Children of the good. corn! The future, the children right now are looking like our world is going to be... Yeah, and the education is going down as well. Yeah. A lot. Yeah. I mean, if you look at what they were taught, like, maybe 10, 20, even more years ago like that, and compared to today, they had a lot more information. And they're actually willing to learn. More so than they are now. I mean, they're still out of rebellion, but those are the people who went off and died. Or went homeless. Anyways. Or blew up. Yeah. Well, it's dying. You don't have to blow up and die at the same time. True. True. Those are the people that shot each other in the faces with bottle rockets. Yeah. Not fun. Don't do that. Oh. But, I mean, like... I mentioned our ages, we're only 18, we haven't been living yeah. in this world very long. Just we're very opinionated. Yeah. I'm really opinionated. And Ryan's pretty opinionated for the most part too. It's bad when someone, people as young as us, they're... Can tell all these differences. Yeah, and can see how bad it is right now. I mean, if that's not close to crisis, I don't know what is. Yeah, crisis. <laughs> and, and we're nerds, so there's yeah. going to be some video game references. Yeah, it and I made like a movie times. reference. If you can name that, you will get two free subscribers. Me and him. Mm. It's near the beginning of the video. Probably. Do I really want to subscribe to someone though? Again, I have 63 subscriptions. That's pretty bad. Well, that's because they subscribe to you. I'm saying yeah, we would subscribe to them if they can name the movie reference I did. Well, I, I'm subscribed to 62 people. Are you? Yeah. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Nah. <laughs> Sheldon from Big Bang. That's a funny show. That's Anyways. But see, even that show, I mean, it's hilarious, but even that has a lot, a lot of references. I mean, they're somewhat subtle, but... What is that? They're not so. What is that? Hey. Playing with a toy. Anyways, um, yeah, like I was saying, they're somewhat subtle, but not entirely. I mean, you can, I mean, when they don't want to be subtle, they're not subtle. I mean, it's mainly an adult show, but, well, not really adult. Big Bang Theory. Yeah. Somewhat. No, no. I don't know. Um, I watched that show even once well. <gasps> What's that one show called? Anyways, back on the movie uh, and TV shows still. Uh, it's been proven that you don't need boobs and nudity and all that to have a good movie or a show. Take the movie Taken, for instance. I am legend. Yeah. Uh, what else? Uh, Hancock. I mean, it was suggested, but it never showed anything. Titan. Well, that was actually kind of bad. Was it? I didn't notice anything. In the, when he takes the lady to the place. It was bad. Well, they didn't do Titanic? Anything. All they do is yell at each other. Suggested <laughs> Anyways, uh, I didn't really like Titanic. I haven't watched that movie in like 7 million years. I don't understand why it's so impacting on emotions. It's just a big boat sinking. People died, Ryan. People die every day. 
That's true. At least one. No, at least five. Anyways. Hi. <laughs> and, uh, what other movies were awesome without nudity? Uh... Napoleon Dynamite? <laughs> no, not really. That was a Um... Hmm... Even if they're somewhat subjective, but they don't show anything, does that count? Maybe. Like, they don't do anything, all they do is just, like, say yes. Like, Disney movies, would those count? <laughs> no, because those are really, well, kind of. It's like subliminal messaging, but it's only yeah. once per movie. Like, The Road to El Dorado, that's an awesome movie. It doesn't show anything. You ever seen that movie? Mm -hmm. Road to El Dorado, yeah. Would that count? No. Ah. But uh, that's for all the people who have been alive for the past... 15 years. Ow. My doggie's cute. Anyways. <clears throat> so, our whole meaning behind this is, you know, times are changing. Change is sometimes good. Sorry about going off topic a lot. <laughs> yeah. That's what I happens. looked at the dog a lot. I'm sorry. We'll probably edit. I think we'll edit some parts out. No, just leave it. Are you sure? Yeah. It's like seven hours. No, it's not. It'll show the time after. It's like out. seven hours. Uh, say maybe a half hour. It's like seven hours. Anyways. Uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully, if you watch through the whole thing. Um, again, if you can name the reference that I did near the beginning of the video, you'll get a free subscription from me. I don't know about him. Uh, what are you doing? Leave your hateful or very negative or very positive or cheerful comments below. 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 And Down we'll have... Here. Uh, we'll have static. No, we'll have fight. I'm clicking buttons. Click the like button. Which is right there. Click the add to favorites. You know what? I think this is backwards. Click the like button. Click the add to favorites button. It Click might be. Is it backwards? Favorites button. I think so. Alright, well, if it is backwards, like button, favorite button. If it's not backwards, like button, favorite button. And subscribe then, is up here. If backwards, subscribe. If not backwards, subscribe. Um, my channel will be on the top right of your screen the way you see it. His channel will be on the top left. Um, what else? You forgetting anything? I'm pointing. Yeah. You forgetting anything? Baxter. Um... Yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment, and leave your great opinions.